Hello, it's me, the Chickachow, famous on the internet for <laughs> famous is a strong word for being bad at video game. How are we all doing? Sorry, I haven't streamed in a few days. Haven't been. Uh... It's not that I haven't been feeling it. It's more that I've been very tired doing a bunch of other stuff. Oh my god, that's very loud. At least a little loud. Might turn that down a bit on my end, don't mind me. Alright, uh, continue. So I haven't done too much since last, uh, last I played. I did a bit of grinding, but nothing like crazy, not like super super it was more to focus on getting bullets and um blood vials and such so if i head over here um you can see i got 80 stored blood vials i got to about 99 of those and i got to 150 of these so hopefully that'll last us the stream so we don't have to uh do too much and we're gonna actually explore the rest of uh not that Rest of our old Yarnum. With the total goal to befriend Jura because I haven't been able to do that. To do that. To do that. Hello, Rose. I don't know why you put those orc faces every time. I assume it's just because you like the orc faces. And that's okay. Maybe it's because the orcs look like me. Do you see the resemblance? But I haven't played uh, Bloodborne for a few days now, so I hope I'm not too rusty. That's the hope, at least. Do I have my lantern on? I do. Okay, so I'm going this way. Well, I missed an item up there, and I don't think I can return up for it, but I can always jump down here later. So I'm going to try to explore this way. I think this is the way that I at least need to go. We'll see what happens. Are they not the orcs? I always thought that orc emote was like the orc from World of Warcraft. At least that's what my assumption was. Looks very World of Warcrafty. Oh hi. If I remember correctly, these guys poison. Is it from Space Marines? 40k? Looks like meat back on the menu. That guy. I did actually swap out my gems on my can as well, so now I don't get the passive regen up for instead more physical damage. May the good blood guide your way. So I'm trying to get to there without falling. I want to see what this guy... How did this guy die? Did he... He fell just off that way. Okay, I think here's the right way and then... Yeah. I don't think we're supposed to go left. Though, just checking here in case. Uh, just a second. So 
Sorry about sorry about that. I won't be able to see chat for just a second. Um Do the funny British voice, yeah. The British the it looks like meats back on the menu, that kind of orc. Why do they give orcs like real cockney accents? Is it because they think they'll talk with their like mouths open? Or is it just like a stereotype that people have always kind of kept? Oh, so this didn't lead anywhere? How the fuck do we get down here then? Are there not streets down there that I'm supposed to go to? Oh no, I do have the HP recovery on. Sweet. Oh, this is a shortcut once I do get down. But how do I get down? Or well, mayhaps the answer lie in an area close to the hunter. Double checking, I'm not supposed to run. I hear people as if they're inside this building. But those guys are definitely dead. I just looked over and I thought my cat was attacking my other cat, which they like to do. They like to play around and play a little rough, you know. Um, and normally they're pretty good about not being too, too rough. But I was like, damn, he's gone again. And it turns out I, it was just my cat turning. You know how cats do that thing where they turn their whole ass body to lick themselves? I'm going to speed run this area real quick. And I'm going to search down here to see if there's any way that I missed. Wait, did I just miss this entire thing, or is this from the church? Oh, I just... I must have missed this last time, then. So the area doesn't look very, um... What's the word? Very familiar to me. Oh, we are in the streets. Okay, so I just missed it last time. You know, I'm kind of scared of these things. Uh, 
I don't know whether I want to explore left or right. Alright, this dog's definitely seen me. And I assume they're going to be powerful, or more powerful than the ones up top. Oh, never mind. I can just combo them. Easy. Can I open you? No, I cannot. Quick little cane. not open okay so that's either a shortcut or something I cannot open just yet or any of these like NPCs no that's just a hole it's just nothing special about it just a hole God, the fucking views in this game are pretty, pretty sweet. Is there like a ravine down there, a river? That dude's just chilling upside down. I keep trying to look up because I don't want to get like oh! I, d I didn't want to get jumped from behind or from up top and just as I said that when you know it Making sure they aren't like Dark Souls statues that come to life and kill me. Holy shit. Bad dog. I don't know if I should go in this area or like keep exploring, so I'm just gonna explore a little bit more for now. Is it what the fuck? You wanna say that to my face? One doggy. He doggy. Ow. He was stronger than the average dog. He was also smarter than the average bear, but that's neither here nor there. Just a second. Alright, sorry about that, just helping out with some things on the side.
That's a lot of bullets. Oh wait, I'm an idiot. I've been looking for NPCs in fucking this place, but like, this place got burnt completely, didn't it? So, there'd be no NPCs or anything. At least probably not, besides like the odd Jura and such. Oh, okay, so that looks like a way to a boss. I want to explore the other way then. Um, oh wait, just a second again, I, pardon me. Okay, hopefully we shouldn't be interrupted for another at least like 20 minutes. Um, I do have some food coming in that I need to grab later, but hopefully it won't be like mid-boss fight or some shit. Because if so, that'd be pretty unfortunate. Also, it just sounds like there's dudes in here. Wary of ambush. Yeah, I was already pretty wary. I thought they were going to drop on me from up there, honestly. Oh wait, can I open this now? Yeah, I can open this tower. Where the fuck's the ambush? Oh. There it is. That's who was breathing into my fucking game. Alright. Now we unlocked a quick way down here. And then once here we can run uh, this way. And I'm going to assume that there's a boss down here. And to that, I say, fuck it, we roll, but... What the fuck's that sound? Is it the spectres? Oh, it must be the spectres. Yeah, it sounds like the spectres. I didn't know they made sound. But that would explain a few things. Alright, who's guarding here? Oh, there's a summon. Alfred. Oh, that's um that's the dude that hates the vile bloods. Alright, dude, you might pretend you're hidden because I can't lock onto you. But that doesn't mean you're actually hidden. Any other secret enemies? Yeah, there are. Any other little jokers around here? So let's say fire of is effective. I feel like fire is always effective in this fucking game. Yeah, there is. You clever little sneak. I 
I don't know what the fuck that is, but it looks kind of like a dog. Oh well, let's give it a go. What's the worst that happens? We die? Blood starved beast. Oh, I might be able to parry it actually. Oh shit. Let's see if I can't bait out a parry. Ow. Maybe I can't parry it. Definitely couldn't parry that one, I don't think. Wait, what the fuck? Oh. I thought it went invisible for a second. I was about to be... Impressed more than anything. Ow. Oh, shit. Is it poison? You know what? Just in case, I might give it a little heal. Was a good underarm shot. Didn't expect that. Oh shit! Damn, it said slow po poisoning, but that is not slow. I'm trying to look for my fucking antidotes. Did I miss them? Oh, there they are. Fuck me, I'm in a corner. Oh. Alright. Let's try this again. The collection is growing. Did I have another fucking clip? Ew! Its flesh sacks are like out in the open now. Oh, just being near it poisons. Don't turn your back to it. Oh, what the fuck? Oh my god! You can fucking parry it! Oh! Thumera? Thumera? Chalice? Thumeru? Chalice? Holy shit! We killed it! Nice. Ooh, what the fuck is this guy? What the fuck? It's like a rat man.
Got antidotes. Is that it? Nothing else in here? What a what a spectres. Huh. Okay, well, defeating that boss should have unlocked something that I can go and do, but I need to remember where it is. I think it's back at the chapel, but first I want to spend my souls. Welcome, what is it? Very well. Let the echoes become your strength. Let me stand close. We ever use magical powers in a Souls game? Probably not. Magic just is not my alley. Now you might be like, Chica, aren't you a bit over leveled? That area is like level twenty or level thirty or something. And to that I say yes. What of it? We get more health, we could get more skill. More skill equals more damage, equals more fun. Farewell, good hunter. May you find your worth in the waking world. We also got a uh, chalice, right? Ritual chalice found in the church of the good chalice. Using a ritual at the tomb altar in the hunter's dream to break the seal of the old underground labyrinth. So do I have to use it on one of these? Oh, I can. Area Thumeria. So I think, I don't remember what, I remember Guy telling me what the fuck the chalices do, but I don't remember like what it actually does, if that makes sense. It is the most fun you can have in a Souls game. Yeah, it is. Fuck anyone who says otherwise. I'll probably ask Guy about that, uh, the chalice stuff, since he normally knows pretty good, like, stuff about them. Um, but for now, I want to go to the Central Cathedral Lord. And I think I can do a few things now. Think is the, uh, the key term. I want to check two things. I want to check the NPCs and I want to check if a certain enemy is around. Do that shit again and I break your fucking neck, dude. Yeah, so that enemy's there. See that guy? That's that's a dude we don't want to fuck with right now. So it's good that he's there. The next person will be down here. But I need to uh to be right back just a second. So hopefully nothing attacks me if I just chill like. I'll chill like over here. Hopefully nothing attacks me. And I will be right back.
right, back we are. Hello. Sorry about that. It's me. Right, hopefully no more distractions, no more interruptions, otherwise, you know, I'll be a bit upsetty with the spaghetti. Oh, I do a lot more damage than I used to, which I mean is a good thing. At least in my humble OP onion. Easy kill the flame lord. Over here, another lantern man. Wow, he didn't hold up the lantern. He outplayed me. I am unmuted, right? Oh, okay, good. <laughs> I was just making sure. I was like, wait, did I remember to unmute? Hello. Oh, thank goodness. You're a hunter, aren't you, dear? Might you know of a safe place? The night is long and there's very little of the incense left. Billy, there must be some nice place to run off to. We want to tell you about the chapel. Oh, thank you, dear. Perhaps I'll see you there. What's this two-bit nonsense you're peddling? I heard you told that wench about some shelter. Well, she's a damn fool to trust an outsider. No why? Well, her sort's probably just fixing to feed some of your coin. <laughs> uh, all right. What crafty lies does the outsider have today? But you think I'm an easy mark? Yeah? Well, give me your best shot. So I keep him alive. He's a cunt. And he'll do the opposite of what you want. So we'll tell him of Isefka's clinic. Huh. Yeah, sorry. Too sharp for that, bollocks. I know a superstition when I hear one. Outsiders. Even their lies are predictable. <laughs> so technically, by lying to him, we're saving him. You know what? I didn't expect to use the whip this much, but the whip's actually pretty fucking good. Wait, that's I was stuck on the lantern. Okay. So I think those were the two NPCs I've missed. Yeah, no. He's gone mental. But we've done that, so now we want to go back to that one enemy I was telling you guys about. And I remember this part. I remember at least doing this and then getting my ass beat. Um, so let me show you guys what, what we're going to do. Oh, this is actually open now. Huh. That's cool. We can go explore that later. Um, for now, we're going to... Not that way. We're going to go this way. Do a little bit of dosy -si do Come over to this guy.
I think this is what we're supposed to do. Otherwise, I just look like an idiot. So Sackman takes us and puts us in jail. Yagul, the unseen village. I think this area is pretty rough, so I'll try to do my best. But no promises. I don't even know which way I'm supposed to go. Madman toils surreptitiously in rituals to beckon the moon, uncover their secrets. Alright, so there's an area to go. What about this way? Music here is fucking mental. Ooh. A friend. God, there's so many like different avenues and ways to go. Y'all go gon' make me lose my mind. Yeah, no, that's exactly what it... Up in here? Up in here. Nightmarish rituals crave a newborn. Find one sil and silence its harrowing cry. Kill a kid? You don't have to tell me twice. Is that thing alive up there? No. Okay, making sure. This guy's got a fucking lamp on his head. Why is the music doing that? I do not like that. This guy has seen me. Is he trying to give me the suck? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do one of these. Damn, you're slow, dude. Can I just, like... What? What does that do? Oh, shit, he's running. Wow. 1,700 fucking shit for that. Alright. Can I backstab you? The answer is yes. Moon. Moon rune. Secret symbol left by Kirill, runesmith of Bergenworth. Transcription of Moon as spoken to the Great Ones inhabiting the Nightmare. Gain more blood echoes. That's just good. I'll have to get that later. Oh, I thought he was moving. I was about to be like, what the fuck? It does not open from this side. It's not open from this side. I don't know which way I'm supposed to go. There's like fucking four ways to go. This place seems like it opens up way more, so I'm going to go down. 
Oh Come here. Come here. Psst, 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 psst. My cat looked up at me as if I was calling him. Not you, Elliot. Me too. Oh, hi there. Yeah, look at the fucking pot calling the kettle black here. Can I enter this way? There's just so many ways to fucking go. I'm apparently emoting on this spectre. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> She's just on the floor. That's the whole spectre. Did he fall from like up high or some shit? These guys give good souls for people that just kind of sit there. Alright, what if though? Oh! Ow! What the fuck? Okay. He just punched me for like more than half my goddamn health. And I have a lot of health. That's not it. Come on, this room. I don't like whatever that was. Alright, that was too early. Let's uh do one of these. Give me some more attempts real quick. Thank you. I remember this area hurting, but not that bad. Is this just a way to leave? Is that another fucking boss? Oh, I didn't mean to summon someone. Whoops. I'm so used to Dark Souls where you have to click it to see what they look like, and I wanted to see what this person looked like before I summoned them, but that just kind of summoned them. Old Hunter Defector Antol. Oh, he has a flamethrower and a... Rifle spear? I can't tell what that is, actually. Well, let's hope you're pretty good then, to fight whatever the fuck this is. Ah. Dark Beast Pal. Alright, I want to see what Antel can do. Ouch. Oh, okay. 
Don't stand next to him. It seems inside him seems to be a pretty good spot until he, like, explodes. Holy shit, flame him, dude. I thought he was going to explode. Ow. Give me your legs. Nice, we knocked him down. Two fucking bosses? Nice. Spark Hunter badge. Badge crafted secret by Archibald, the infamous eccentric of the hunting of uh, the healing church for his friends. Archibald was fascinated by blue sparks that emanate from the hides of dark beasts and dedicated his life to its artificial re reproduction in a style of inquiry that accidentally closely followed the methodology of Bygenwar. Or Bergenworth. And does this lead back to the streets that we were in before? Yes, this is Old Yarnum. Okay, if I've done this correctly, then I think I can actually befriend Jura? I knew Dark Beast Powell by his name. I didn't know what the boss fight was about, but I read the notes on befriending Jura because I really wanted to do that this time around. Ow! What the fuck? So we want to make our way back up here. Not through there. Is that dog humping a window? Oh, that's the dog that fucking fell down on me when I went to pick up the item. Oh, to me it looked like it was humping a fucking window. So if I've done this correctly, Jura should be friendly to me. Just in case I haven't, though. Um, we got to get a quick escape button. Because I, I don't think I would ever be able to beat Jura at this current stage.
Well, well. How did you get in here? It's no matter. What brings you to old Yarnum? I've no interest in matters further up. But you must not disturb this place. The beasts do not venture above and mean no harm to anyone. If you still insist on hunting them, then I will hunt you first. You understand me? Spare the beasts of old Yarnum. Yes, very good. I no longer dream, but I was once a hunter too. There's nothing more horrific than a hunt. In case you fail to realize, the things you hunt, they're not beasts. They're people. One day you will see. Mm. It's time you got going. But first, a farewell gift. I have no use for it anyway. What is it? Surely I need not repeat myself. Go, I say. You have the whole night to dream. Make the best of it. Well, goodbye, I go. Adjacent to Bray's campaign. Yeah, yeah, it does. But I wanted to do Jura's quest so bad. I felt so bad when I had to kill him the first time. But now, as long as I don't kill shit in front of him, he won't get upset. So that's pretty pog. That's pretty pog champ. Pretty poggers championship. That's very super pog. That's a that's a big pog from me. A big old P O double G. Welcome home, good. What is it? All right, let's level up. Very well. Let me. Those guys hit like a truck, so I'm gonna put some <laughs> more into health because I'm fucking scared as hell. Farewell, good hunter. May you. Now, do you have anything interesting to say? The healing church and the blood ministers who belong to it were once guardians of the hunters in the times of the hunter Ludwig. They worked and forged weapons in their unique workshop. Today, most ministers don't recall the hunters, but they have much to offer you. And so, heed the message of your forebears. Ascend to Erden Chapel. I already did that. Also, what's up, Dusty? How you doing, bud? Welcome to the stream. Alright, can we buy anything fun from here? Oh, we still got the gas coin stuff. Doing good, good to hear, good to hear. The big Bloodborne fan. Oh, we can buy Ritual Blood. What else can we buy? Ah, the Stake Driver. A trick weapon fashioned by the Workshop Heretics. Powder cakes favoured by the Tired Hunter Jura. The stake driver, with its queerly complex design, violently drives thick stakes into the flesh of foes. Stake driver allows for high damage critical attacks, but is difficult to use. Wow, it does not sound like my my kind of weapon. And the Tonatrus. Unique trick weapon contrived by Archibald, the infamous eccentric of the healing chirp workshop. Striking this particular iron morning star flare like a match generates the same blue sparks that blanket a dark beast. Oh, like dark beast pal. Fortunately, for reasons I'm told, the hunters of Archibald's time didn't fully take to the device. That's kind of cool. Bloodborne is my favorite game of all time. Well, I'm glad to be, hopefully, trying to complete it for the first time. And I'm sorry if I'm bad. Alright, let's try explore the rest of this uh, jail. At least that path led to like a path back so I can clear out that path completely. I think the up top where the other lamp was was kind of uh, 
the place where I'm going now leads out to more open areas, so I'll try search underground first. Come here, buddy. Come on. Come here. I got a present to show you. Come on, man. I swear, it's a cool present. Oh, I forgot to put in my moon rune. Oh well. I'm not gonna teleport back now just to get more blood echoes. So we've entered that room, now let's try search the rest of down here. This is where we woke up. We'll just a dude with a there's a lot of like weird lamps in this game. I don't know if lamps are like symbolism in this game for something. Oh, oh what the fuck? Oh that scared the shit out of me. In the name of the healing church, cleanse us of this horrible dream. <laughs> Where are you? Hey, buddy. Oh, please leave me be. Don't take me, please. Oh, please, dear God. Oh, it's all right. I won't hurt you. Oh, please leave me. Don't take. Oh. Will you not talk to me? Oh, don't. Oh. Okay. Church guard required. I don't know what that means. Do I have any church stuff? No, I don't. I've got a sick chalice, though. Oh, garb. Oh, yeah, yeah. Wearing trust garb. So she wants to talk to someone from the church. Well, at least I know she's there. Which is good because that's a dead end, which means I can just keep exploring this place one way. I love the fucking chanting in this place, but it's also creepy as hell. Oh wow, you think you're fucking sneaky, huh? Guess what, I can sneak too. Make you want to say hellfire. Almost. Oh shit. There's little oinkers up there. I want to explore here first though. A lot of knife dogs. Oh wait, these aren't knife dogs, they're just dog dogs. Ow. Oh, that dog just fell through the floor, I guess. Hello, sack man. Fuck, that was too uh, early. There we go. Piglet, what happened? Oh, bother. It's the, uh, the blood and honey, Winnie the Pooh. The horror version. Did anyone, like, legitimately watch that whole thing? I know some critics just have to, but, like, kudos to them, I guess. Okay. If that door... Is what I think it is. This is just in that area that I was. Yeah. It's just a shortcut to get down here. Which, I mean, I guess. I don't know why you have a shortcut there. It wasn't hard to get to here. 
At least not particularly hard. Is there a path up top? There might be a path up top for the other door. Because there was another door on this like side here. It's just gore and boobies. Ah. There's the piggy. Can you enter here? Oh shit, you can! I didn't want a fist to pick today, but here we are. Do we ever get an item to make our, like, blood vials heal more? Like, Dark Souls have the Estus upgrades. Also, do I want to go up or down? Behold, a pale blood sky. I... I don't see a pale blood sky anyway. I mean, it looks kind of orangey. Give me a Winnie the Pooh anime with vibes of Full Metal Alchemist. Oh god. You know what, I'm gonna check down here first. Because I think down will probably be the wrong way. Only because the other doors up top are in like a higher area. Black hooded iron, black yagul, black garb, a bunch of yagul armor. Does it look cool there? Iron helmet worn by the hunters of the unseen village. The hunter of yagul answers to the village founders, the school of Mensis. Hunters in name only, these kidnappers wear black hoods low to, the shadow, to shadow their eyes. This helm is made out of metal, a rarity for hunters garb, and has high defense but only against physical attacks. It's not the worst. So I primarily defend from physical attacks. The bind the binding of thick ropes serve to both protect its wearer and restrain the foes. So this is the kidnapper attire. I don't think I want to wear kidnapper clothes. Just on a you know principle. Oh, a bunch of madman's knowledge. Someone died here? How'd they die? They were fighting something and died. The executioner rune. Wait, is there a rune somewhere? Did I miss something? Oh, that no, that is closed. You have to do Alfred's quest. Okay, and Alfred's quest is the he wants the wild bloods. Right. Well, let's explore this part of the chapel since I haven't done this part yet. Oh! God, he's a fucking tanky one, isn't he? Nice. Cable roots. Oh, okay, yeah. I see what you mean. Alright, so we've unlocked this, which is a quick way to get down to here. Which I guess is cool, but like, the front door was right next to us. These shortcuts aren't feeling very short right now. They're feeling like very... They feel like Mario Kart shortcuts, where you take it and it saves you like 
a good five seconds, but it's not like necessary. Just a pig chilling there. Can I like just making sure? Maybe if I pull him out to like this area, I could. Okay, so that's a shortcut. To up top, which I assume we get through here. No, we don't get through here. Well, it wasn't the cleanest kill, but we still ended up making bacon. A lot of dogs in here. I don't particularly like dogs. I mean, it, dogs in real world are fine. Bloodborne, they're kind of, uh, kind of annoying. They tend to put more of them in Bloodborne than in, like, say, Dark Souls. At least I feel like I've seen more Bloodborne dogs than Dark Souls ones. Where are the other animals, though? I want to see, like, a, a beast horse. A boars, if you will. Or perhaps a beast cat. Why do Dark Souls games only got to have dogs and spiders? rid of the most dangerous obstacle and dealt with the dogs by accident because I was just trying to switch weapons oh the tonitrus I'd need more strength for that we already read that cool is this your first playthrough kind of uh, this is technically my second playthrough up to this point I say this point um, I have a crippling fear of spiders, absolutely hate spiders, um, to the point where I couldn't keep playing the game. Um, and it wasn't actually ROM that did it to me, it was just a little thing after ROM that I wasn't mentally prepared for, and then I put down the game and hadn't played it since, and this was about in what, 2018 maybe? So I'm back at it. I don't know where the fuck I'm supposed to go from here. Do I have to go in like one of the houses? Am I missing something? Like don't get me wrong, this game's amazing, but that really put me out of the game. 2018, yeah. It's amazing because it's actually a pretty old game, all things considered. It 
it's a shame we didn't get like a PC port or anything for it. In my opinion, this game would have probably done a lot better with one. Alright, I thought I was onto something here, but... I'm... Unless I'm crazy, I think that's all we can do in this area. You might know Dusty. Can I do anything else in this area yet? Or no, not really. Think you're done with it? Okay. It's quite a short area. That ghost almost scared me. This dude just chilling on the fucking stairs, dying still. Calm down. Yeah, we opened that one. We didn't open that door. Alright. I guess now we can finally try fight Vicar Amelia. I don't think we... Oh no, we have the other place to explore as well. We've got to explore the place next to... um. That opened up in the Odeon Chapel. I'm trying to save Vicar Amelia for a bit. Because I personally know what happens around that. Welcome home, good hunt. What is it? Do you have any fun thing to say? Over time comes a great it all. No. Okay. Very well. Gives me out, so I just fight the boss, pick up the garb and head out. Yeah, there's that lady that I need to help, but I need church garb for. Alright, let's put on more health. More health is good. Farewell, good hunt. Let's see if we can't get another level up here. Vicar Amelia kicked my ass. Welcome, what is Alright, how much is Very that well in terms of level ups? We need six thousand more for another one. 5,000 more. In that case, let me just sell something real quick. No offense to the uh, Tonitrus, but I don't think I'm going to use that or the Rifle Sphere uh, anytime soon. Holy shit, the Tonitrus was 13,000? I almost got another level up. Hold up. Let's sell some more stuff. I don't think I'm going to use this black garb, the the kidnapper garb, so I'm going to sell that. Anything else I can sell? Grand Spurt of Beasthood. I don't know what that means or what that does. Numbs the brain, hides your presence. Don't sell those. Alright, I won't. Numbing mist prevents HP restoration. That seems only useful against, like, PvP. I'm gonna sell a couple of these. Strengthens quicksilver bullets. I'll keep that just in case. I have 58 bloodstone shards. I might sell like 10 of them. Just get a quick 2k. That should give me some more level ups. Welcome. What is it? The numbing mist? Oh, okay. Very well. Let me. Does she heal? That might help her with healing. Okay. 
Could do health. Do one in health, one in skill, one in endurance. Farewell, good. I like getting my endurance up as well, but that's probably a byproduct of me constantly using um shields. In Dark Souls games. Wait. Bloodstone chunks I need for my cane. What's blood gem? Oh yeah, blood gems are these stuff. Huh. I only got one triangle one. Yeah, no, I'm just sticking with my physical attack up and fizz up at full HP. I use shields. I played this game first in the series. I played um the original Dark Souls and got my ass beat constantly. Um, then I played Dark Souls three, and I watched the Dark, Dark Souls. There, there, there. I watched Dark Souls two playthrough because I just I didn't quite enjoy it as much as the others. Tomb of Odeon, right? A cathedral ward. Back when I played Dark Souls and stuff, and I have a clip on this Twitch channel actually about me fighting one of the DLC bosses without getting like a full hit. All of my hits were perfect, shielded or dodged after dying to that boss like 26 times or something. It was pretty crazy. I was pretty proud of it. I enjoy using shields in Dark Souls because I feel like if you weren't supposed to use the shields, why are they in the game, right? Oh, they're in the game to parry, but there's shields that can't parry. There's, you know, different types of shields. There's different types of combat. A lot of people get upset when it's like, oh, you just use shields and go through the bosses with shields. Yeah, that's how I enjoy to play. Hey, how you doing? Oh, hello, dear. You weren't lying. This is a safe place. Thank you. I am in your debt. I'd like to tender my thanks, but I can't imagine what to offer. I just like big sword. All I can give That's fair. Is my blood. But would you even take a whore's blood? Uh, I don't think I should take yes, anyone's I blood. I suppose that's natural. I won't try to tempt you. <laughs> I don't want your blood, Rose. I mean, whore. Yeah. Stay away from me. I know all your tricks. Okay. Ah, oh, you. The swindling off-comer. Did you really think that'd work? There's no fool in me. Now, off we go. You heard me. Go away. I can't stand the stench of your lying breath. No, oh, Dusty. That's a good attitude to have. I wish more people had that attitude. Let me just send that down because knowing my luck, I'm going to die. Oh! Thank God I can go through bullets if I dodge. Communion. Com com communion? <laughs> me English? Good. Communion. Max vials held plus one. Does that... Does that really matter, though, very much? I guess it's better than more blood echoes. Because I'm not really hurting for blood echoes. Oh, shit. There's a couple snipers up ahead. Son of a bitch. Didn't know that guy showed up. Everyone said he didn't show up. Yeah, so that guy, I actually remember it. Um, he hates you, so he'll go to the opposite place of where you tell him. So if you tell him to go to um, the clinic, he goes to the church and vice versa.
I love the Dark Souls series and Bloodborne stuff. <laughs> no, well, thank you for being here. Um, I love the Dark Souls series and stuff, but some of their quests and the NPCs are so fucking ridiculous. Like, sometimes they have, like, very obvious hints of what you're supposed to do, but other times it's like, oh, make sure you talk to... Make sure you talk to this guy with this in your inventory and then perform this emote while doing a backflip. Um, and I'm just like, okay, you know. Uh, th why do Dark Souls games always have one of these? Where they have like, hey, there's this area that you have to parkour off, you know, carefully, otherwise you'll die instantly. Six hundred and seventy hours in the game, and I'm still learning shit. Yeah, I mean, for people who like playing a game over and over and over, Dark Souls is great. You know, I almost learn something new pretty much every time I play a Dark Souls game, or a Souls-like, I should say. But sometimes it's also annoying if, like, you're a completionist. Messenger top hat, nice. Should read the tooltip for every single item. Yeah. It's like, oh, you want the full lore about the whole game? Make sure you watch the um, tooltip for every item. Or, alternatively, make sure you watch that one dude on YouTube. You know the one. I don't actually remember his name, but there's a dude that just, like, counts the Dark Souls lore. Oh, shit. I thought I was dead there, so you know what? Could have been worse. Ew, what the fuck is that? Oh, he knows fire. Bro's a Kingdom Hearts character or some shit. Ow. Beast. Transcription of Royal Labyrinth Beast. Bearer of the Beast Rune has accentuated temporary transformation effects. Ah. Oh. Okay. Is that the new lead character? Yeah, may as well be. Got platinum a year ago this month. Oh, nice. An NPC. <laughs> a night of curses. A night to remember. Wouldn't you say, friend? <laughs> Not today, buddy. Rumpled Yarnum hat, sweaty clothes. Where the fuck am I? Don't know where I am, and I think that's scarier than like anything they could fucking throw at me. Oops, that was way too early. <laughs> wow. Whoops, I fucked that up, but you know what? That's okay. That guy did a lot of damage with that final hit. Yeah, I thought he was gonna end the combo there, so I was like, okay. Oh shit.
There's just so many places to fucking explore of this area. I assume, like, we're in the streets and this is, like, the main road, right? These guys don't give shit or XP, though. Or blood echoes. Thank God we don't live in a world like this. I would constantly shit my pants. My pants would be one color and the color would be brown. Alright, what enemies here to gank me? Oh, is this one of those fucking... Yeah, it's one of those, like, little fucking slithery cunts. Oh. Okay. You know, I see that. I see where we are. We're just above the summon, right? Yeah, we're just above the summon. Above Vicar Emilia. Come here and fight me like a man. But what is a man? A man who casts spells. Oh shit. Uh, I, I will check that in a second, but thank you. Alright, am I safe? Thank you, Dusty, for the follow and welcome to the flip side. Oh shit, they've, I've pissed them off. Alright, never mind, they're not aggroed to me. Thanks for the follow. Very excited to have you. Man, I'm feeling good. I got my first YouTube subscriber the other day. I got my first Twitch follow in a while this day. Feels nice. Keep in mind that isn't a call for help for people to subscribe to the YouTube or anything. It's more that like the YouTube is there as a VOD archive because Twitch auto deletes VODs, right? So I have it there to just kind of store all my streams in case anyone ever does want to go back and watch them. And then someone subscribed and I was just like, damn. That's it just number go up, make me happy. Same reason I play RuneScape. Can't stay up much longer, I gotta go to work. I hope you enjoy work and thank you for uh, dropping by. Go find out what the fuck's happening in this tower, though. Oh, wait, there's a chest here as well. That was almost a little bit hidden. I'd like to see more of your playthrough. Well, uh, luckily for you, not only will I be hopefully streaming it every single day that I can, um, but we do have, the, as I said, the YouTube. It'll go up on the YouTube eventually. Blood attack. Huh. Fire attack, HP continues to recover. Kinda like that. I like the HP recovering, it's always fun. Right, chickens with viewers, yeah. Now, Rose is here by our moral obligation. Rose is actually just here for Kingdom Hearts.
Why do the fucking people in the wheelchair laugh like they're goddamn Joker? Oh. It's one of you guys. Alright, I shouldn't fuck this up unless I'm really bad. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> the walking backwards was pretty funny. Alright, let's try this again. Wow. I fucked it up. Because I'm bad. There we go. There's a couple more regulars here. <laughs> I might never get those regulars, though. It might literally just be you and Daybreak forever as, like, my main regulars. But that's okay. Nice one. Idiot. Did he shoot me as he was falling down? Oh, no. He's not dead! No way. Now he is. Just me for a while, but now there is worse. Yeah, it used to just be Daybreak when I first started streaming. Then I got really lucky and got a, um, a host from Final Fantasy Speedrunner. And I got subtraction pretty quick. Um, but then it's just because I was living with my parents and everything. It was hard to constantly stream. And then sharing stream schedules with my brother because we had bad internet to the point where we couldn't... It was bad. We could still stream, but we couldn't stream at the same time. Otherwise, uh, it would fuck up both our streams. And then I fell out of it because I just... I wasn't enjoying it. But now, like... I love playing games. <laughs> I just... I love playing games so much. Don't be fooled. You must accept Old Labyrinth. What does that mean? What does that mean? Why does it have 3,000 things? Sky and the Cosmos are one. The Choir. What? It's better than no regulars. Yeah, it is. No, I'm very, very grateful to have not only my friends, but my partner supporting me in all this. Oh, there's just a way that way, huh? I think I'm more happy too that I turned off ads on Twitch. Because, yeah, I don't get any passive income or anything at all from Twitch, but that's, like, I don't have you guys missing out on story because of a fucking ad. Please tell me you bought the DLC. I, I, th I think I did. Um... Your add-ons. Yes, I have the old hunters. I'm excited because I do know that Lady Maria is a thing. So I do want to fight her. Lock. I went all the way up here for a locked fucking door. Oh, shit. Okay, awesome. I don't want you missing out. No, I want to experience the full game as much as possible. Which is, again, why I kind of don't like the fact that Dark Souls is a bit, you know, privy with its information about quests and such. But that's okay. Don't want to roll off. I'm looking for the ladder. Where the fuck's the ladder? Souls game, this door is locked, yeah. This door is locked. Story of my fucking life. Well, I guess there's nothing to do now that except for fight Vicar Amelia. Corpse should left. Well enough alone. What emote is that? Jesus. His toast. That sounds funny as hell. I can't tell what it is on the phone, but... I like animated emotes. 
God. I feel like a, you know, an old person when I'm like, back in my day, Twitch didn't have emotes that could be animated. <laughs> this is what it used to be, though. I mean, back in my day, Twitch didn't even used to have raids or... Twitch Prime didn't exist. Subscribe to him, nice. People saying kick is up and coming and stuff, but I ain't about that life. Oh, he has my soul still. Ow. Ow. I don't know what that does. I'm gonna be real. I'm trying to be careful. I don't want to waste too much health on this guy. World's first runs. Ah, so he's like, let me solo her, but the Bloodborne equivalent, huh? He gives one of those things where I thought I understand it has good attention, but gonna burn out would be good. You see, I'm all for a competitor that goes against Twitch, but I've seen a bunch of stuff about gambling on their site, and I do not endorse any of that kind of stuff. And also, I, I'm not a real big fan of, um, XQC in general so when a company pays you know 10 million dollars to have him on his site I'm kind of just a bit sus like good for him but I don't know it was a very weird sounding deal T 100 million dollars was it or 10 million one of the two some shit like that for XQC to stream on their platform, but not even exclusively. That's the part that was like, huh? Do they just have... M I heard that they were own owned by a, um, a casino. So I don't know how, like, truthful any of the deal and stuff is. But it would explain why they can splurge like that much money for a single Twitch streamer to non-exclusively stream on their site. And then XQC did some dumb shit, I think. Where he literally just started streaming a Batman movie on their site and one of their mods had to come in and say like, no, you, you, you can't do that. Alright, what's up, buddy? Oh, that was too early. Alright, I'm not gonna use another blood vial to up my health here because... Oh, vice versa, sorry. I'm not gonna use another bullet thing because I think bullets, they're not quite as useful in this fight. All right, 20, 20k souls on the line. Let's try this out. Definitely hurts a lot less now than she did before.
Well, that wasn't so hard. I'll have a good rest of your stream. If you're still playing later, maybe I'll catch you on your break. Thank you. I don't think I will be, but thank you, and I hope you have a good day at work. TY fellow follow and welcome again. My sentiments exactly, Daybreak. I can't believe that boss kicked my ass. It's crazy what 30 levels will do to <laughs> do to a motherfucker. We also got a, uh, a gold pendant. Pendant of Vicar Amelia used to change into a blood gem which fortifies weapons. I don't think I'll use that. It's probably an important quest item or something. Master Willem, I've come to bid you farewell. Oh, I know, I know. You'll think now to betray me. No, but you will never listen. I tell you, I will not forget our adage. We are born of the blood. Made men by the blood. Undone by the blood. Our eyes are yet to open. Fear the old blood. I must take my leave. Do I go back to the Hunter Dream now, or where the fuck do I go? Maybe I'll go ask the fucking old dude what to do, or the... Mr. Wheelchair himself. See if there's anything new to buy here. Nothing there. Nothing here either. Uh, my rooms are pretty good right now. Where's the old dude? Oh, what the fuck? Eye of a blood drug hunter beckons hunters to the hunter's nightmare. A deformed creature will wish you away outside Odeon Chapel. So, do we go back to the Hyperion Jail now? Welcome. What is it? Very well. Let me. Because that's what I did. I got whisked away. Whist. Some more health. Maybe some more endurance. Nah, more health. Hunters have to have but. I am a dog. Would you ever think to love me? Of course, I do love you. Isn't that how you've made me? That's fucking Farewell, weird. Good. Feels like some Stockholm Syndrome stuff. Wait, is it Stockholm Syndrome? What's what's the syndrome where you love your capital? Oh, Lawrence. What's taking you so long? I've grown too old for this. Of little use now. I was gonna say Parkinson's, but that's a disease. Well, he was talking about Lawrence, so he knew Lawrence, which was the guy in the, the car.
cutscene, right? With Master Wilhelm. Stockholm, yeah. So you guys know more than me. Alright, do we go back here? Maybe I'll give this place a little wonder. I honestly don't know what to do. Um, but we fought, what, three bosses this stream? Which is, you know, three more than the last stream, I'm fairly sure. Wait, no, last stream I killed the witches, right? Three more than the second stream. Unless, did I kill Gascoigne on the second stream? Shit, three more than the first stream. <laughs> Daybreak, stop. People might think you're at telling the truth, and then guess what? They'd be right. Oh, no way. When did you get so aggressive? Don't suck me. Damn it, I keep doing it too early. Too late this time. Alright. Call me Goldilocks. Because I'm about to hit it just right. Never mind. Alright, there's this bitch behind this wall, right? Yeah. Me too. I'll give this place a little search, and if I can't figure out where to go, then I'll just uh, probably end stream. Maybe down this way? now? Nope. Two hours went by fast. Yeah, I mean, it's, we're getting to that point. I think it's because we were constantly doing something and we weren't having to backtrack. I think in these kinds of games, when you start to have to backtrack a bunch, is when it starts taking up quite a bit of time. Like we did, we searched an entire new area, a bunch of entire new areas, in fact, we didn't stop searching new areas since we got here. Um, and fought three bosses, one of them is, we only fought once before. I've got no fucking clue where we're supposed to go there. I will try teleport back to the Hunter's Dream and see if he says anything and he's not asleep fucking wheelchair man. And I'll also make sure to ask Guy about the, uh, the Chalice Dungeons. Alright, 
Sorry, wakey wakey old man. Oh, she's not fucking here. Ascend to Odeon Chapel. I don't... I don't know where that is. Like, I assume it's... The Cathedral Ward, since that's the Tomb of Odeon. Maybe we'll check the Church of the Good Chalice again? I don't know. Maybe if they came with, like, a fucking map or something? <laughs> oh, this is the wrong place. I do not want to be here. Lest I piss off Jura. Hunter's Mark. That's a D&D &D spell. See, this is the part where the stream slows down and feels like it takes forever. Maybe I just run down this way. Something happens, maybe. Oh, shit. Excuse me, sir. Why are they glowing blue? You walk down the steps. Oh, wait, are you asleep? Oh, no, you're not. I've just been doing this from the fucking beginning. Oh well, I got all my blood vials back at least. Why? Why are they gonna be extra? You know what? I could probably just run this. Yeah. 
Are you still hunting after me? Oh, there's not a dude over here now. Are you still there? Yeah, you're still there, you fucking dumbass. Do you say anything? Never get into this mess. <laughs> I'll spare you one nugget of advice. Beware the blind man. There the beggar sits at the bottom of the bloody food chain, and then he's here acting like he owns the place. He's not to be trusted. What's he want with all those people anyway? That little weasel has a murky past, I'm telling you. I have a feeling that that guy's just lying to me, like he always does. Oh, you. I'm sorry. I'm afraid I can less. No, I don't want... I don't want your whole blood. Ah, oh, the hunter. Thank you. So, well, he don't offer me much in a way of conversation, but still... I'd rather see him alive anyhow. And... Oh, I sort of hope that my asking you turn out that, you know... Help him out in the end. I've never been any use to anyone, you see. Just happy about it, is all. <laughs> you say anything about if the whore? Find any saint, send him a lot to her. <laughs> okay. I've got no fucking clue what I'm supposed to be doing. Are there supposed to be people that like walk down here? Yeah, where are all the enemies? What the fuck? Alright, well, I'll ask my friend on what to do. My little player guide, my non-spoiler player guide. And I'm sure he'll tell me what's up. So until then, I'd like to thank you all for watching. Thank you all for the support so far. Uh, I'll have one more go at the old man at the hunter's dream, but he probably won't even be there and he'll probably just tell me to go up the fucking chapel, which, how do I do that? Who knows? Who fucking knows? So thank you all for watching, thank you all for the support, even though I had to uh, be up here quite a few times there. My name is Chicka Chow, but I'm on the internet as Chicka Chow, and I'll catch you all on the flip side. Bye bye Goodbye. Bye-bye. Bye. Goodbye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.